My home is split between two units. I live in the downstairs unit and throughout most of the winter, I heat this space with my stove. But the catch is you need a lot of wood to do that. <sighs> and now that it's getting colder, I have to split a lot of wood, do a lot of leaves. And it feels like it takes forever. I'm usually not done until spring gets here. So let's get started. Over the years, I've had to take a few trees down because they were either sick or dying or just needed to clear the space. There was a tree right here when I got the house. That's what, eight feet from the back door? It was way too big to have that close to the house. So we took that down and I burned that for two years. There was another tree there. I burned that for two years. It's right there a couple of weeks ago, you can see we did some tree work to clear limbs that were hanging over the house. So through the fall, as we do a lot of the work to clear leaves and pick up all the sticks, I keep a burn going. Speaking of sticks, somebody's doing some work and I split wood. That's the project for this afternoon. I'm gonna split some wood. For years, I've been using a Grand Spurs Brooks splitting mall. This right here is my absolute favorite splitting mall. The best one I've ever used. I love it so much, I bought two of them. previously mentioned, these are some very, very large trees. And they're also old and they're messy. So they drop a lot of leaves and drop a lot of sticks. And living on a lake here, every year we lower the lake so that we can clean up the lake bed, clear up the rocks, get rid of the brush, try and keep it as clean as possible. So what I do every fall is bring sticks down to the dry lake bed and have a big bonfire. That's the start of it. There's a little bit more. I have no idea how big this is going to be, but it's going to be a lot of wood. But it's a lot of fun because you get the fire going, you stoke it, go do some yard work, grab a book, sit by it for a little bit, and then you get to enjoy the sunset while you're sitting there next to your giant bonfire. I guess there could be worse ways than this, spending time working on your yard, 